Top 10 Highest International Goal Scorers of All Time Hello viewers, welcome to another exciting edition and thanks for watching. Today we shall be talking about the top 10 highest international goal scorers of all time. Representing your national football team is something every footballer in the world aspires to do, but to score a goal for your national team is a great achievement. While club football might have more fortune and popularity, being chosen to don the national colors is a rarity that players do not job with, as it sees them act as ambassadors for millions of their compatriots and they get the opportunity to represent their country either positively or negatively. However, the feeling of being your national team's record goal scorer is an indescribable feeling. The outcome of a football match rotates around goals and over the years, many great players have shown their respective national teams through their goal scoring powers. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our amazing videos. Though it is not as frequent as club matches, tournaments like the World Cup and Continental competitions offer players the chance to shine in national colors. While the qualification stages for these tournaments and friendlies also add to the pomp and pageantry of international football. Many players have single-handedly won laurels of their countries through their goals. So let's take a look at the top 10 international goal scorers of all time as at the time of recording this video. Number 10. Sunil Chetri, 72 international goals. Born on the 3rd of August 1984, Sunil Chetri is an Indian professional footballer who plays as a striker or winger and captains both the Indian Super League side Bengaluru and the Indian national team. Popularly known as Captain Fantastic, having scored his second highest number of goals in international matches among active male players after Cristiano Ronaldo, he is both the most capped player of all time and the goal scorer of the Indian national team, with 72 goals in 115 appearances. He is the current captain of the national team. Sunil Chetri was named as Indian icon by AFC on his 34th birthday. On the 30th of March 2004, Chetri played his first game for the Indian U20 team in the 1-0 victory over Pakistan U23 team in the 2004 SAF Games in Pakistan. On the 3rd of April 2004, Chetri scored twice for the Indian U20 team against Bhutan U23 team in their 4-1 victory. On the 12th of June 2005, Sunil scored his first goal for the senior Indian national football team against Pakistan. On 15th October 2019, Chetri has become the only Indian to secure a place in the list of top 10 footballers who have scored maximum goals in international football. Chetri started playing football from a young age, taking part in various tournaments. On 4th December 2017, Chetri married his longtime girlfriend Sonam Bhattacharya, who is the daughter of the former Indian national football player and Mohun Bagan, legend Suprata Bhattacharya. He signed a three year deal with global sports giant Puma India starting from 2020. Number 9. Basha Abdullah, 75 international goals. Basha Abdullah, born on the 12th of October 1977, is a former professional Kuwaiti footballer. He was a part of the mini revival of Kuwaiti football between 1996 and 1998. His sport included winning two Gulf Cups, reaching the semi finals of the AFC Asian Cup, and coming second in the Arab Cup and Asian Olympics. He was also in the Olympic team that reached the 2000 Olympics in Sydney. He also helped his club Al Samaya win the league three times and Emmy Cup once. On the 26th of November 2015, he announced his retirement friendly match on January 13, 2016 between Al Samaya SC and Al Hilal FC. On the 25th of May 2018, he came back to play a testimonial match for Kuwait against Egypt. He obtained 134 international caps with his national team, has entered the symbolic but exclusive circle of players with a century of caps. He also scored 75 international goals for Kuwait. Number 8. Kinishige Kamamoto, 75 international goals. Kunishige Kamamoto, born on April 15, 1944, is a former Japanese football player, manager, and politician. He won the bronze medal with the Japan national team at the 1968 Summer Olympics in Mexico team, finishing at the tournament's top scorer with 7 goals and is the all time leading goal scorer for Japan. He served as a member of the House of Councillors between 1995 and 2001. He grew up in Kyoto and attended Yamashiro High School. Then he was on to Waseda University School of Commerce. He became a top scorer in the Kanto University League for four years in a row. He also won the 1963 and the 1966 Emperor's Cup at university. This was the last time a university team won the Emperor's Cup. His major was Commerce and he earned a Bachelor of Arts degree from Waseda University in 1966. In October, he was selected by Japan for 1964 Summer Olympics in Tokyo. He played all matches and scored one goal. In 1968, he also was selected by Japan for 1968 Summer Olympics in Mexico City. Japan won bronze medal and he became a top scorer. He played all matches and continued being selected for national teams. 
He also played at 1966, 1970 and 1974 Asian Games. In 1977, he retired from national team. He played 76 games and scored 75 goals for Japan until 1977. Number 7. Sandor Coxes, 75 international goals. Sandor Peter Coxes, who lived from 21st of September 1929 to 22nd of July 1979, was a Hungarian footballer who played for Ferenc Kavos TC, Budapest Honved, Young Fellows Zurich, FC Barcelona, and Hungary as a striker. During the 1950s, along with Ferenc Buskas, Zoltan Zibor, Josef Bosgis, and Dando Nigetogi, he was a member of the Mighty Magyars. After the 1956 Hungarian Revolution, he moved to Spain where he became a member of the FC Barcelona team of the late 1950s. Coxes was a prolific goal scorer for both Budapest Honved and Hungary. While playing for Honved, he was the top goal scorer in any European league in both 1952 and 1954. He also scored 75 goals in 68 appearances for Hungary, a 1.10 goal per game average at the game's highest level. Coxes was a top goal scorer in the 1954 World Cup with 11 goals being the first player to score two hat-tricks in the World Cup. His 2.2 goal per game average in the World Cup Finals is second only to that of Ernst Wilmorowski, who scored four goals in his only World Cup match, and only Just Fontaine, who has scored more goals than Coxis in a single World Cup. Coxis was particularly known for scoring headers. Sandor Coxis registered seven hat-tricks for Hungary. Number 6. Pele, 77 international goals. Born on the 23rd of October 1940, Ensign Arantes do Nascimento, also known as Pele, is a Brazilian retired professional footballer who played as a forward. While regarded as one of the greatest players of all time, he was among the most successful and popular sport figures of the 20th century. During his playing days, Pele was for a period the best paid athlete in the world. In 1999, Pele was voted World Player of the Century by the International Federation of Football History and Statistics IFFHS, and was one of the two joint winners of the FIFA Player of the Century Award. That same year, Pele was elected Athlete of the Century by International Olympic Committee and was included in the time list of the 100 most important people of the 20th century. According to the IFFHS, Pele is the most successful domestic league goal scorer in football history, scoring 650 goals in 694 league matches. His total of 1,281 goals in 1,363 games, which included unofficial friendlies, is a Guinness World Record. Pele began playing for Santos at age 15 and the Brazil national team at 16. During his international career, he won three FIFA World Cups, 1958, 1962 and 1970, being the only player ever to do so. Pele is the all-time leading goal scorer for Brazil with 77 goals in 92 games. In Brazil, he is hailed as a national hero for his accomplishments in football and for his outspoken support of policies that improve the social conditions of the poor. Throughout his career and in his retirement, Pele received several individual and team awards for his performances in the field, his record-breaking achievements and legacy in sport. Number 5. Hussein Said 78 International Goals Hussein Said Mohammed, born on the 21st of January 1958, is a retired Iraqi footballer who played as a forward for the Iraqi Premier League club Al Talaba and the Iraqi national team and is a former president of the Iraq Football Association. Said is in the fifth place in the list of top international association goal scorers with 78 goals. Along with Ahmed Radi, he is considered to be the best Iraqi player of the 20th century and features in 25th place in Asia's best players of the century list. On the 24th of April 1987, Saeed broke Fala Hassan's record to become the most capped Iraqi player with 110 caps. Hussein is currently the Iraqi national team's highest scoring player with 78 goals. Saeed started his professional football career at the age of 17 when he joined the Iraqi national team, a varsity football team and won the 1975 Arab Schools Games gold medal. In 1975, he joined Al Talaba where he spent all 14 years of his career achieving three league titles and getting the top goal scorer of the league award in three seasons. He won two AFC U19 championships, two Arabian Golf Cups where he was the top goal scorer of both occasions and the best player of one, a World Military Cup and an Asian Games gold medal. Number 4. Godfrey Chitalo, 79 international goals Godfrey Chitalo, nicknamed Uka, who lived from 22nd of October 1947 to the 27th of April 1993, was a Zambian footballer who played as a forward. He is widely regarded as the greatest Zambian player of all time as he holds his national team's goal scoring record and was voted Zambian Footballer of the Year five times. As well, he was selected by CAF as one of the best 200 African footballers of the past 50 years in 2006. 
The Football Association of Zambia claimed that Chitalo scored more than 100 goals in all competitions in Net 72, more than Jared Muller's total in Net 72 and Lionel Messi's total in 2012, both of which are often referred to by journalists as world records. The research was presented in the year 2012 after Lionel Messi broke the alleged world record of Jared Muller. Nevertheless, a FIFA spokesman declared that an unofficial FIFA world record had never existed as they did not keep track of domestic competitions. Upon retirement, Chitalu took to coaching and was in charge of the Zambia national team when the entire squad perished in a plane crash off the coast of Gabon on 27 April 1993. Godfrey Chitalu Road in Lusaka is named after Chitalu. In December 2012, Kabwe Warriors renamed the railway stadium as the Godfrey Chitalu Stadium and announced plans to erect a statue in its honor. Number 3. Ferenc Puskas, 84 international goals. Ferenc Puskas, who lived from the 1st of April 1927 to 17th November 2006, was a Hungarian footballer and manager. Widely regarded as one of the greatest players of all time, he was the son of former footballer Ferenc Puskas Senior. A prolific forward, he scored 84 goals in 85 different international matches for Hungary, playing 4 international matches for Spain, and scored 514 goals in 529 matches in the Hungarian and Spanish leagues. He became an Olympic champion in 1952 and led his nation to the final of the 1954 World Cup where he was named the tournament's best player. He won three European Cups, 1959, 1960 and 1966, 10 national championships, 5 Hungarian and 5 Spanish Premier Division and 8 top individual scoring honors. In 1995, he was recognized as the top scorer of the 20th century by the IFFHS. Puskas started his career in Hungary, playing for Kispest and Budapest Honvéd. He was the top scorer in the Hungarian league on four occasions and in 1948, he was the top goal scorer in Europe. During the 1950s, he was both a prominent member and captain of the Hungarian national team, known as the Mighty Magyars. Number 2. Cristiano Ronaldo, 100 international goals. Cristiano Ronaldo dos Santos Aveiro, born on the 5th of February 1985, is a Portuguese professional footballer who plays as a forward for Serie A club Juventus and captains the Portugal national team. Often considered the best player in the world and widely regarded as one of the greatest players of all time, Ronaldo has won 5 Ballon d'Or and 4 European Golden Shoes, both of which are records of a European player. He has won 29 major trophies in his career, including 6 league titles, 5 UEFA Champions Leagues, 1 UEFA European Championship and 1 UEFA Nations League title. Ronaldo holds the record for the most goals assists in the history of the UEFA Champions League and for the most hat-tricks in recorded history. He is one of the very few recorded players to have made over 1,000 professional career appearances and has scored over 700 senior career goals for club and country. A Portuguese international, Ronaldo was named the best Portuguese player of all time by the Portuguese Football Federation in 2015. He made his senior debut in 2003 at age 18 and has since earned over 160 caps, including appearing and scoring in 10 major tournaments, becoming Portugal's most capped player and his country's all-time top goal scorer. He became the highest European international goal scorer of all time in 2018. On the 17th of November 2019, Ronaldo scored his 99th international goal in a 2 0 win over Luxembourg, leading Portugal to qualify for Euro 2020. Number 1. Ali Dai, 109 international goals. Born on the 21st of March 1969, Ali Dai is an Iranian former professional footballer, football manager, and businessman. A striker, he was the captain of the Iranian national football team and played for clubs such as Bayern Munich and Hertha BSC. He is currently the owner and CEO of Dai Sports. A tall forward, Dai was a prolific goal scorer who was known for his heading accuracy and ability in the air. He is the world's all time leading goal scorer in the history of men's international football with 109 goals scored for Iran, an achievement least in the Guinness World Records. During his playing career, Dai was appointed a UNICEF Goodwill Ambassador in 2001. Playing his last game for Iran in 2006, from June 2007 until 2013, Dai was a member of the FIFA Football Committee. Dai was also called up to join Team Meli on the 6th of June 1993 in an Echo Cup tournament held in Tehran where he made his debut for Iran against Pakistan. He continued his national team appearances and was named the top goal scorer of the final Asian round of 1994 FIFA World Cup qualifications with 4 goals in 5 matches. Despite criticism, Dai played in the 2006 FIFA World Cup. The criticisms, however, were directed more at his fitness and the inability of younger players to play a part in the World Cup. From Iranian media calling for his retirement, Ali Dai has always defended his position in Team Mali and has rejected that he was too old to play for them. Thanks for watching. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. 
share with your friends, subscribe to our channel and turn on post notification.